uh, we just didn't play well enough. You know, didn't handle uh, the field position or the, or the conditions well enough in the first half. I thought our I thought our defense gave us a winning performance. You know, and, and we just got to be able to play it on offense, special teams. It was, it was tough for both teams. You know, that, that's not just us. You know, and so then it, it comes into managing those conditions, um, doing a great job running the ball, which which I was pleased uh, for the most part with what we did in the run game and then, and then special teams the field position. And so I, I think that they did a better job handling that than we do, um, than we did today. And, and so you got to give credit to them there. Zach, what did you see from Joe? I, I saw some good things from Joe. You know, that's a really tough defense. Um, and again, it's a real challenge when – when, when the passing game is going to be like that, you know, with those conditions, especially in the first half. Um, but I thought we settled down. Uh, we just weren't good enough overall on third down, you know, 2 of 15, 3 of 15, whatever it is. That's not a winning. Um, you're not able to extend your drives that way and, and keep your defense off the field. And that's really what it boiled down to. Yeah, how, how frustrating is some of the miscommunication, pre-snap stuff? I mean, you harp on that. It seemed like there was more of that than I imagined. Yeah, we you know um, there, there was one time it was late getting the play call in, so we had an illegal shift because we had too many guys moving because the play clock was down. You know, so that that one's on the play caller. Um, there's another one we had a, a legal formation. You know, we were just hugged a little bit too tight, and and that thing sometimes can go both ways. But that, that it is what it is. They clearly communicated why that was. Um, so those are the two that really come to mind for me there. Do you think the Todd Burrow miss maybe had any impact on some of the some of the breakdowns? Say that one more time. The Todd Burrow miss. I don't really think so. I, I think early on it was immediately a different game than we've had to play in a long, long time, you know, with the rain. And so I only say that because of how it affects both quarterbacks in the game. How much was the calf injury issue? I didn't. You'd have to ask him on that. Did you see him a Watson draw run there before half? It's a good check, you know, or a good, good call, however they had it. Um, it was a good call against against the look we had. We were being aggressive, which I like. Um, so I like the call we were in. And, and again, their players on scholarship too. They did, they did a nice job executing there. Whether the way that the offense was going backfield, you get that touchdown right before halftime, or did this feel like the offense was going to click in in the second half? We felt like the offense was going to click. You know, obviously you you, you don't want to give up a touchdown there, um, but felt like we had two good drives to start the second half. Uh, went down and kicked the field goal in the first one, and, and then got the turnover and went down and missed a field goal I think on the second one. So felt like we were we were in a better groove and, and had some more momentum. Um, again, the third downs is really the, really what bit us overall in the game. Was this the weather that kind of limited? There's no question, but again, that's that's both teams there, and so then it becomes a different game where you just got to do a great job managing the field position, um, winning the kicking game, doing a great job managing your run game, and and uh, we, we all contribute to that being better. Zach, was there some consideration of going for fourth down and one first down after a fourth? Um, no, I, we, we were hopeful not to get a touch back there, obviously, and flip the field position. It's a long field goal with those conditions um, that we were just discussing. And so, you know, we just needed needed the field to flip in our favor to try to punch in some of those points and and uh, unfortunately got a touch back there. And so ended up being a 19-yard punt or whatever. In a game like this, you feel field position can maybe be one of the biggest factors in determining the I think playing in our division, it certainly is. And then playing with that weather, it absolutely is. And so it's twofold there. And again, we just, we didn't, as a team, didn't do a good job just handling all that. Zach, I know every year is different, but just the last couple of years, the slow starts out of the gate, do you see any overlap in why this team has had a missed? I think every year is different. Rotating DJ Turner and Cheeto, a load management kind of thing. It is, yeah. So that, that'll, that every week we'll have to look at that. But for week one, that's what that was. What did you tell your guys? That this certainly isn't the team that, that we're going to be. Um, and, and we all understand that. And so there's going to be some things that we have to learn from from this game. We're going to be in another type of game like this, whether it's weather, whether it's on the road and things not going our way early. Um, we just got to stick together. But but I, I, this is a team that knows that. And so there's, um, on our end, we all understand that. And we got to quickly put this one behind us and go have a great performance at home next week. I, I don't really care about any of that. I don't really care about any of that. Was, uh, was there just not many chances from there in the game? In the middle of the field? Over the middle. Yeah, we, we tried a little bit of everything. Thank you all.